Welcome to the Cullen Smoothie Bar, day in the life. Kind of. Hey guys, welcome to the Cullen Smoothie Bar. How are you guys doing today? Good. Doing good? Oh, I like to hear that. Where are you coming from? Uh, Newtown. You're in from Newtown? Yeah. Ooh, I heard that's a beautiful place. How's the wife and kids? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Dog? Yeah. Like strawberry? That one definitely from out of town. I think she's speaking a different language. <laughs> Over sir, different language. <laughs> so what can I get you? Ooh, there you are. You know your flavor. That's a guy I like to know, huh? How about you, sir? Pumpkin. It must be that red hair that's getting you liking the pumpkin, huh? Dad, what color do you guys need? Pumpkins are orange. Ma'am, there's no, there's no standing on the bar. Yeah, what do you think this is? Whiskey a go go? Get off the bar, you! Don't get my bouncer out after you. No. no. All right, one vanilla smoothie, one pumpkin smoothie, and what would you like, princess? Oh, a pink one? I can make that happen too. All right. Sir, do you happen to have dog flavors? Asking for a friend. <laughs> you can't have chocolate, right? No chocolate. So we, we can get some kind of plant-based item in there for her. <laughs> All right, should I do my Tom Cruise bartending skills? Yeah! Yeah! Oh my God! All right. You ready to go? Yeah! Who wants to see a delicious smoothie in the works? Me! Let's do this. Me! All right, first up, we have... Our mixed fruit, right? I'm gonna make this for everybody in the family. I gotta make it big. So, I'll get you some pumpkin, kid. Don't you worry. All right. So that's probably big for the normal smoothie, but since we're making it for everybody, I'm going bigger. Go home, right, guys? If you're into strawberries, you could do more strawberries. You could do cherries. You can do blueberries. I worked out this morning. Dad went hard, so I get to have a few bananas in there as well. So now, for my tasty fat, Tom Brady's avocado it makes the smoothies nice and smooth. Another tasty fat, almond butter. Sir, remember that lady you overserved? <laughs> Getting out of control. <laughs> almond butter. Mmm. Get this at Aldi's. The cheapest one you can get because almond butter can be pricey. Healthy scoops of almond butter. Mm -mm -mm. Delicious. Now we have our, our almond unsweetened milk. Mm -mm -mm. I fill it, no matter what the size is, I fill it to the top of the fruit. Uh, sir, you never let uh, friends drink just protein and water, right? Protein or milk? Water, no good. I've heard people try that before and they hate the smoothies. That's the reason why. All right. Now we get to pick our flavors. So we have many, many flavors for my bar, and they're all fantastic. I'm a big fan of the vanilla. We have chocolate. We also have coffee flavor, pumpkin spice. In the past, I've gotten strawberry flavor, and this was amazing, cinnamon roll flavor. And this made for amazing, healthy, rice crispy treat things that I eat all the time. Yeah, so some of these proteins are great in smoothies. Others, we'll show you some snacks that you can use them in later on through the day. But also we put in these, especially during our cleanse, is our clean tox. That's for your, uh, not the clean tox, I'm sorry. Hold on, cut. <laughs> Gut health. The gut health. Everybody has problems with their gut, right? Going helps helps regulate you. Jojo, how's your regulation? I think I just changed a diaper. I think you go pretty good. Regulation we all need our regulation as good as this uh, two-year-old here. <laughs> and that that will do the job, won't it, Jolene? Alright, baby. <laughs> Get our so for a regular smoothie, it's two scoops per smoothie. Since this is a little bit bigger, I'll probably 
Go three. <laughs> Our smoothie's almost as tall as Jolene. Orange, yellow, yellow, orange. Hey, thank you. Can orange, you sit in your seat, Missy? Thank you. All right, and then to top it all off, we have our baby spinach. Mm -hmm. Baby spinach. Again, a handful of that in there. Usually, just top it off. And sometimes this may make for a thick smoothie, so I'll add some water into it just to make it so it's not as thick. But that also is another thing too. Some people make it look like on purpose, add fruit, and you almost have like a yogurt bowl. Yeah, so I'm not a big smoothie person. I'm a, a, I'm a food person, so I like to eat. Um, so if you make these a little bit thicker, you put them in a bowl and you get yourself a smoothie bowl. So good. All right, here it goes. Now it is helpful and good to have a, a blender. You don't need top of the line, but it's helpful. And when we help people that are working in the office and want to make um, smoothies, you know, but might not have the ideal office setup, we have discovered there are um, battery run blenders. So that is helpful too. And then it's a whole entire family affair. I like to have my smoothies in a fun cup with a straw. So figure out what works for you in a smoothie. Jimmy likes to have his in more of like a travel um, type I go to go. My Jimmy so goes giant. I create this as my meal for the morning. So I'm a, cre I'm a creature of habit. So before I did this, did the cleanse two years ago, I would eat what I like and I eat the same thing. I had a peanut butter and English muffin every day white or english muffin right? too muffin. not even a weed english muffin it was something i was in and it was unhealthy after i did the cleanse i love these smoothies so much i for two years i've had these basically every single day uh -huh. <laughs> they are so easy and they taste delicious they fill me up till noontime and i'm good to go uh gentlemen here at the bar first time newcomers or regulars New. newcomers oh uh, how, what do you think? What do you give the smoothie? A thumbs up or a thumbs down? A triple thumbs up. I love it. All right. Last call. Last call for smoothie bar. All right. See you all soon in our next video. Can everyone say goodbye? Bye. We'll take you.